Hi, I'm Jerry. I work for an agency called PAVE. That stands for Partnerships for Action, Voices for Empowerment. I work with families and schools to make sure that students get the help they need for learning. Sometimes learning can feel hard when there's a lot going on. Sometimes we can feel like we're all stirred up and we just can't think clearly. Today, I'm going to show you a trick that I use when my mind feels all stirred up and I want to settle down so that when I'm ready to say something or do something, I feel truly clear on what I want to do or say. This is my beach jar. I made this jar by putting some sand and shells and marbles in the bottom of the jar and water. And I also took a hole punch and made little circles of aluminum foil because I wanted to make it sparkle. I didn't have any glitter in my house, but if you have glitter in your house, you could put some glitter in your homemade snow globe to make it extra sparkly. So before I show you my beach jar, I want to share with you something that I learned from a man who lived more than 2000 years ago. His name is Lao Tzu and he was a philosopher. Anybody can be a philosopher because a philosopher is somebody who thinks about things long enough to say something or write something meaningful that helps other people understand too. Lao Tzu said this, do you have the patience to wait? till your mud settles and the water is clear. Can you remain unmoving till the right action arises by itself? We're going to use the beach jar to practice three important words from that poem. Wait, clear, and action. If I take my beach jar, remember there's sand and marbles and shell in here and water, and I'm going to shake it. Look, it's all cloudy. That's what my mind feels like sometimes when I get all stirred up. So I'm going to look at the jar that's all stirred up and I'm going to put my own lid on by putting my hand on my head. And then I'm going to breathe and I'm going to wait. I'm going to breathe in and out and in and out. I'm going to breathe one more time like that in. and out. Now I can take my lid off and notice that the water in my jar is starting to get clear. So I wait until there's a clear water and then does it make sense what I want to do or say, my action? I hope you might make a beach jar so you can wait and get clear before you act when you feel all stirred up. Have fun and have a good day.